hi guys welcome back to my channel so in the previous videos we have seen couple of videos regarding the DynamoDB so how to create a table how to update a structure of table how to create local secondary indexes global secondary indexes we have seen how to do all these operations using AWS command line interface so in this video we will learn how to insert a data into a DynamoDB table using a command line interface that AWS command line interface so we will take a sample table for this demo so this is a student table we have created with the partition key as student name and sort key as subject name so if you go into the subject into the student and just see the table items explore table items if you see there are no items here so we will try to add an item using a command line interface so first the basic command to list what are the DynamoDB tables we have in our account is AWS DynamoDB list tables so if you just enter we will get the array of table names so we had only student table so we got a student table so before this you need to set the credentials in your credentials file under dot aws folder in your home path so after that if you run this command it will connect our account and it will list the tables so now we will see the command to put an item into this table so this command is aws dynamodb and what we want to do we want to put item so we will just write put item and after this command we need to mention what is the table name we want to put and what are what is the item description so first table name is student and item just type item So here we can give the file path where we saved the item description means the attribute and a value the key value pairs. So if you check the key value pair I have saved here. So this is the structure we will send to a DynamoDB table. So if you check here there is a student name and there is subject name this is a partition key and this is the sort key and we are passing values as ashok and maths and here if you see it is s means it is a string so we will give a path to this so either we can give path or we can directly give this inside a command first we will just give inside a command then we will see how to give file path so let's compress this file content copy yes open json beautifier yes compress it and next we will give the command so what is the command aws dynamodb put item table name student and item just paste it here and let's enter this so item invalid json expecting property name enclosed in double quotes line one column so expecting property name enclosed in double quotes 
Jason received is student name Ashok subject name maths So if we give remove this item so still it is giving error subject name so if we give double quotes then here single quotes that won't work so still there is some problem let's check so we have to try one more we'll just give single quotes here yes so now this command works so what we need to give we'll just write it again aws dynamo db put item and continue the command give table name student continue the command and give item item we need to put in single quotes if you are directly giving the whole json so we have compressed here so we will just copy this and paste it here so this is the whole command we need to put item so after entering the item will be inserted let's go to our account and check so now just run this here you can see the student name ashok and subject name maths so here we have given only two attributes partition key and sort key so it is coming as ashok and max maths so if you write one more attribute just copy this structure then score just write score just write this as a number and mention what is the score just 99 so just copy this just compress it again and this is our command we just need to paste it in item if we enter this then the new attribute should be added in the dynamodb so let's go to our account let's run it if you see there is one more score added to this record so we are putting an item if item already exists it will add a score or it will add a new row so in our command if you change partition key or sort key it will create a new row let's say name as ROM so now if you refresh we will see one more row ROM maths 99 so in this command what we are doing we are giving a direct JSON structure inside a command itself but we can give a reference to our file just type file and 
what is the file name file name is item dot json which should exist in the same path same directory json and let's change the score ashok maths just change score to 80 so if you enter it will take a json structure from this file and it will update it will put an item if already exists it will update otherwise it will add a new record if you just refresh presently ashok maths is 99 if you refresh if you see the score is 80 so this is how we will just put an item to a dynamodb table using aws command line interface i hope you like this video and understood please like share and subscribe my channel for more videos and updates thank you for watching